Paul Scholes has been at the heart of Manchester United's success for the last 10 years. Great goals, tricky skill and an overpowering will to win have combined to make him one of the first names on the team sheets of club and country. He's loved by the fans and treasured by his teammates. He's a quiet man, but um, he's well appreciated by the fans here and of course by uh, his teammates. If he's not scoring goals, he's really setting them up. Uh, and he must be a nuisance for the opposition. And again, we feel very lucky that uh, he's a Man United player. Paul has come through the same ranks as the young academy players. Now it's his turn to coach them. Brad, can you come out? Could you, Brad, if you are the defender now and Paul does that, are you ready, Brad? Because he's going to come at you. I think it's important to, first of all, try and make you look that way, you know, so just as if we're going to go this way, so you're looking, I mean, all of a sudden, a little drop, drop of the shoulder and, and try and get away and get your shot in or your pass or whatever it may be. The basic thing you're trying to do is off-balance him, you know, trying to get him, get the defender to go that way and, and you sneak off the other way and, you know, hopefully then you can, you can get your shot in or your pass or, you know, whatever you want to do. Do you think, Brad... You can do it. Right. Shall we have a go? Can you try? Come on, then. You do it with Paul. Yeah, oh, brilliant. Good. Excellent. Excellent. Can you do it again, Brad? Now a little bit pace. Come on. Oh, very good. There's, on, there's, there's, one, there's one thing, Paul, which stands really out, I think, with both you, both you see doing it. It is that when you lean in to that defender, like you said, to have balance it, this needs to go really quick, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> like that, because that sets you off. Putsy, just come out a minute. Right, <clears throat> let's see if Putsy, you can do this. If I beat Paul like that, boom, all the time, and I do it, have I got another skill to still make him believe I do that and suddenly I do something different? You think, Putsy, what do you think then? What would you do? What would you do? Come on. Oh, brilliant, fantastic. That's a great variation. Are you, are you with me, Paul? You yes. think? It's like, is that a good one? Yeah, it's very good, yeah. If, you know, if you can't, obviously can't be trying to do the same thing every time and if you've, you've got a little, little bit of variation to go the other way, then that's ideal. For this skill to really work, you need a moving ball. As the defender expects a Matthews, swing your kicking foot around the ball and push away with the other foot. Can you still remember, Paul, when you were their age, was there a particular player which you really favoured for, you know, skill-wise, looking at the TV and thinking, wow, look at him. Well, skill-wise, there's uh, people like Maradona, you know, watching him in the World Cup, the, the, the things he did and the way he went past players, I suppose, was, you know, it was fantastic for children like me to watch. I think it's, it's vital to have players that can go past, past players with, you know, with great skill. Um, Ryan, obviously, you mentioned, and Rude as well, the, the fast feet and the, the skill they show to get past players is, is great, and it, it creates opportunities and, you know, chances for...